hello everyone you're welcome back to my channel thank you so much for stopping by so we are going to be making this beautiful collar neck okay so stick with me as i take you through the process so i already have my fabric joined at the shoulder and i have um the space right there you can see that space is three inches okay so i'll go right ahead now to fold my fabric into two and then i'll go right ahead to fold it into two again you fold it just as if as if you want to cut a flare okay so i'll, I'll go right ahead to fold it again so making it four okay four folds all right so i'll go right ahead to mark out my um measurement so for the tip i'm going to make sure that i have four inches right there remember the fabric is unfolding four places so that will give us about 16 inches which is very okay for an average neck okay so go right ahead and mark that out okay just mark out that spot all around and then by the time you measure we should have about four inches right there right so that is what i'm doing right now i'm marking it right round to give me about four inches so i'll use the chalk to make the line more visible now okay and then checking it out it gave me four inches okay i hope you do get this all right so we are doing it as if we are cutting a flare so right now i will move over to the length so i'm going to be using two inches for my length okay I'm going to be using two inches so just mark two inches all around okay just mark two inches all around using the first line that we that we made as the base okay so mark two inches all around all right can it give this video a thumbs up and please do not forget to subscribe to my channel so moving on i'm cutting out what i have now okay so simply go right ahead and do the same thing just cut it out all right and um, we will be cutting two of this one is going to serve as the main and the other one is going to serve as the lining okay so i'm going to cut one side open all right because we have a zipper allowance at the back or whatever fastening you want to use okay so now i'm going right ahead to cut the second piece which is going to serve as my lining all right so go right ahead and do um the same thing if you're not if you're not using the same fabric the other fabric you want to use as a lining you're going to place it on fold just like this and place the other one on it and then we'll be cutting it out as well kindly give this video a thumbs up subscribe to my channel and feel free to share so others can get to see it okay thank you so much guys i'm counting on you so i'm cutting it out now and then i'm going to open up the side two just like i did with the first one all right so i have um my two cutouts now the main one is going to serve as the main fabric and the other is going to serve as the lining so this is what i have at the end of um, my cut okay you can see that i have a beautiful circle now so the next thing that i'm going to be doing is to add my interfacing to both okay and then we'll move right ahead in the tutorial okay all right guys so now that is done you can see how beautiful it is looking okay so this is going to give it more weight okay so um i'm going to place both together and then i'm going to turn the inner part which is going to serve as the neck okay so right now i've done that and i'm going to notch it okay so that it remains flat after ironing okay so just go right ahead to give it a beautiful notch be careful so you don't notch into your stitches okay so go right ahead and notch it just like i'm doing and then i'll go right ahead to um do another stitch and then i will iron it so this is what i have after ironing you can see how flat and beautiful looking it is all right so right now i'm going ahead to um, mark out the center okay just place both together and mark out the the center okay you can give it a mark or you can give it a notch so i'm trying to locate the center of this color right now okay so remember i have a little space i have about three inches space in front okay so now i've gotten my center which is why i'm putting a notch there okay so right on both sides of that notch i'm going to 
measure out one and a half inches on both sides okay remember this um, space that i have i'm going to also leave it open when attaching the collar i have three inches there so right at um, on both sides of the notch that i made at the center i'm going to mark one and a half inches to one to the left side and then one and a half inches to the right side as well okay so this is going to give me a total of three inches for the space that i have in front all right so i'll go right ahead to uh, pin it in place now okay so i'm going to be pinning the edges of that space to the the lines that I, the marks that i made on both sides of my collar i hope you do understand just watch what i'm doing okay so i'm placing one side on the one and a half inches mark that i made on one side and then the other edge i'm going to place it on the second um mark that i made now remember that i'm not attaching the mid part that i notched at all okay so that is the center of my fabric i hope you do understand just watch the video to understand what i'm trying to explain okay so this is what i have i hope you can see it so i'll go right now to sew it all around and this is what i have so beautiful guys thank you so much kindly subscribe to my channel bye